Hi, this is Chuck with AroundVanBuren.com. Our creek runs about 500 feet through our property, and I'm restoring it. Branches, leaves, everything falls in it. Garbage, too. However, it's got more serious problems. During heavy precipitation, it runs very strong. This digs gouges out of the banks. Sometimes that makes trees fall. When the banks collapse, the water makes a new path. This repeats over and over, decade after decade. When it digs these gouges deep into the center of the creek, more collapsing happens. They built a wood dam 65 years ago, and that became an earth dam. The ground behind it raised up over two feet. Once upon a time, the creek flowed straight into this culvert where it leaves our property. Now it makes a kind of funny angle turn into the culvert. The creek became destabilized in several different places. This was once a pond. And this might have been a second pond. Here I picked one channel for the creek. And then I shut down this second channel, which you can just barely see the outline here. In several places, it overflows its banks easily. There's no banks you can see here. In this stretch, the creek had three channels. The dam is long gone, and in its place are roots and earth. So I asked the USDA what to do, and they suggested firming up the banks with Christmas trees and uh, cabled logs, make it run in just one channel, and support the destabilization areas with shoots and rocks.
Here's the dam just a few years ago. My rocks. Christmas trees along the edge of the bank that's getting gouged out. The pond started about here. The dam now. Everything before the dam used to run wherever it wanted. Everything after the dam used to dig deep gouges which collapsed the earth over and over. Looking into the dam, I dug a path under the roots and earth and filled it with rocks. And now we're heading to the culvert. Before I contacted the, the local USDA office, I checked with all the local municipality government agencies for oversight of the creek. No one claimed it. So the state of Michigan told me that makes it a natural water course. I still can't bulldoze it though. That's what the uh, state and the local people told me. Coming up to the culvert and the end of the creek on our property. It makes that sudden turn towards the culvert. I added all the rocks in the creek. These rocks prevent it from gouging a new path heading away from the culvert. At least the creek runs in one continuous channel now from beginning to end. The destabilization has been addressed. I'm still watching it, however, and making changes as necessary. Thanks for watching.